Dear Harry, would you like to come and have a cup of tea with me this afternoon? I want to hear all about your first day. Hagrid. Hagrid's bound to be in his hut. Come on, Harry, follow me. Harry? Make yourselves at home. This is Ron. Another Weasley, eh? <laughs> I spent half my life chasing your twin brothers away from the forest. Hey Ron, somebody broke into Gringotts. Listen, believed to be the work of dark wizards or witches unknown, Gringotts goblins, while acknowledging the breach, insist nothing was taken. The vault in question, number 713, had been emptied earlier that very same day. That's odd. That's the vault that Hagrid and I went to. Hagrid, I need to collect some ingredients for potions class. Do you know a good place to find plants in the school grounds? I have a lot of strange things growing out near my garden. You're welcome to go take a look. Be careful, mind. Wouldn't go wandering round at night. Then again, there's some pretty fearful things in here during the day. There you go. Be careful, Harry. There's nothing more we can do. I'm for bed. There must be a door around here somewhere. 
Maybe I should try using the Lumo spell. Merwin the Malicious. Medieval, dates unknown. Credited with the invention of many unpleasant jinxes and hexes.
Morgan Le Fay Medieval Dates Unknown King Arthur's Half-Sister Dark Sorceress Enemy of Merlin Burdock Muldoon, 1429 to 1490, Chief of Wizards Council, 1448 to 1450. There's nothing more to do, so I'm for bed. Fancy trading wizard cards, Harry? Why not? Glenmore Peaks, 1677 to 1761. Famous slayer of the sea serpent of Cromer. 